The team gauged the temperature of this cold galactic gas, roughly 400 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 200 Celsius. Chandra has mapped iron K-alpha in other galaxies. In this one, it helped us study individual bright X-ray sources in the cloud to help us rule out other potential origins. Besides the black hole, said Jenna Kan, a co-author and postdoctoral researcher at Goddard. But NGC 4945's line extends so far from its center that we needed XMM Newton's wide field of view to see all of it, added Can in the release. The findings indicated that this identified jet produced a powerful wind that continually pushed cold gas through the galaxy. Scientists even proposed that it may help birth new stars in this galaxy. The team will continue to monitor this galaxy using high-tech telescopes to uncover how this colossal black hole is influencing the galaxy's overall evolution. Hi everyone and welcome to A Bit Scientist, where we discuss anything science. In today's video, we will be discussing how NASA found galactic fossil in a galaxy 13 million light years away. Please remember to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. NASA scientists have identified unexpectedly massive clouds of cold gas within the spiral galaxy NGC 4945, located 13 million light years away. As per the release, the revelation of this cold gas serves as the discovery of a galactic fossil. The observations suggest that the gas likely rushed through this galaxy following the outburst from its supermassive black hole some 5 million years ago. The scientific team suggests that this highlighted cold gas is possibly an ancient remnant of a particle jet emitted by this black hole, lurking at the center of this galaxy. These recent findings have the potential to provide insights into the broader understanding of galaxy evolution. There's ongoing debate in the scientific community about how galaxies evolve, said Kimberly Weaver, an astrophysicist at NASA's Goddard Space Flight Center in Greenbelt, Maryland. We find supermassive black holes in the centers of nearly all Milky Way-sized galaxies, and an open question is how much influence they have compared to the effects of star formation. Studying nearby galaxies like NGC 4945, which we think we're seeing in a transition period, helps us build better models of how stars and black holes produce galactic changes, explained Weaver. NGC 4945 has been classified as an active starburst galaxy with a substantially greater star production rate than the Milky Way. Interestingly, the galaxy can produce the equivalent mass of 18 stars like our sun every year. NASA scientists conducted observations of this active galaxy using ESA's satellite XM and Newton X-ray multi-mirror mission and NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory. The data indicated the Iron K alpha line, which stretched well beyond the galaxy's core. As per the release, this signature line appears from the interaction between highly energetic X-ray light from the black hole's disk and cold gas in the distant surroundings. There's ongoing debate in the scientific community about how galaxies evolve, said Kimberly Weaver, an astrophysicist at Goddard who led the work. We find supermassive black holes in the centers of nearly all Milky Way-sized galaxies. And an open question is how much influence they have compared to the effects of star formation. Studying nearby galaxies like NGC 4945, which we think we're seeing in a transition period, helps us build better models of how stars and black holes produce galactic changes. NGC 4945 is an active galaxy about 13 million light years away in the southern constellation Centaurus. An active galaxy has an unusually bright and variable center powered by a supermassive black hole that keeps a surrounding disk of gas and dust through gravitational and frictional forces. The black hole slowly consumes the material around it, which creates random fluctuations in the disk's emitted light. As with most active galaxies, NGC 4945's black hole and disk are shrouded by a dense cloud of dust called a torus, which blocks some of that light. The cores of active galaxies can also drive jets of high-speed particles and generate strong winds containing gas and dust. NGC 4945 is also a starburst galaxy, which means it forms stars at a much higher rate than our own. Scientists estimate it produces the equivalent mass of 18 stars like our sun every year, or nearly three times the rate of the Milky Way. Almost all the star formation is concentrated in the galaxy center. A starburst event lasts between 10 and 100 million years, ending only when the raw material to make new stars is depleted. Weaver, NASA's project scientist for XM and Newton, 
and her team looked at NGC 4945 with the satellite. In their data, they saw what scientists call the Iron K Alpha Line. This feature occurs when very energetic X-ray light from the black hole's disk meets cold gas elsewhere. The gas measures around minus 400 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 200 Celsius. The iron line is common in active galaxies. But until these observations, scientists previously thought it occurred on scales much closer to the black hole. Chandra has mapped iron K-alpha in other galaxies. In this one, it helped us study individual bright X-ray sources in the cloud to help us rule out other potential origins besides the black hole, said Jenna Kan, a co-author and postdoctoral researcher at Goddard. But NGC 4945's line extends so far from its center that we needed XMN Newton's wide field of view to see all of it. Because NGC 4945 is tilted nearly edge-on from our point of view, XMN Newton was able to map the extent of its iron line both along and above the galaxy's plane, tracing it out to 32,000 and 16,000 light years, respectively, an order of magnitude farther than previously observed iron lines. The science team thinks the cold gas highlighted by the line is a relic of a particle jet erupting from the galaxy's central black hole about 5 million years ago. The jet was likely angled into the galaxy rather than pointing into space, driving a superpowered wind that's still pushing cold gas through the galaxy. It may even have triggered the current starburst event. Weaver and her colleagues will continue to observe NGC 4945 to see if they can discover other ways the black hole is affecting the galaxy's evolution. The same X-rays from the disk that are currently highlighting the cold gas may also begin to dissipate it, since stars would need that gas to form. Scientists might be able to measure how activity around the galaxy's black hole can quench its starburst phase. There are a number of lines of evidence that indicate black holes play important roles in some galaxies in determining their star formation histories and their destinies, said co-author Edmund Hodgescluck, an astrophysicist at Goddard. We study a lot of galaxies, like NGC 4945, because while the physics is pretty much the same from black hole to black hole, the impact they have on their galaxies varies widely. XMN Newton helped us discover a galactic fossil we didn't know to look for. But it's likely just the first of many. The temperature of cold gas. The team gauged the temperature of this cold galactic gas, roughly 400 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 200 Celsius. Chandra has mapped iron K-alpha in other galaxies. In this one, it helped us study individual bright X-ray sources in the cloud to help us rule out other potential origins besides the black hole, said Jenna Kan, a co-author and postdoctoral researcher at Goddard. But NGC 4945's line extends so far from its center that we needed XMN Newton's wide field of view to see all of it, added Kan in the release. The findings indicated that this identified jet produced a powerful wind that continually pushed cold gas through the galaxy. Scientists even propose that it may help birth new stars in this galaxy. The team will continue to monitor this galaxy using high-tech telescopes to uncover how this colossal black hole is influencing the galaxy's overall evolution. So this is our today's video. If you like our video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel or hit the bell icon. We will meet again with another interesting topic till then, stay safe and stay happy.